a very good afternoon aspirants of uh, jobs very important jobs the graduates in engineering and the diploma holders also a good news for you is the announcement from the government of india regarding the jobs that are opening up in the coming months and years and to start with the good news is the staff selection commission going to open the job market rather to say for junior appointment of junior engineers in the government of india various organizations of government of india and this uh, is a very welcome uh, gesture from government of india to the graduates who have been waiting many years for this opportunity to come forth and we are from engineers sub i am dean academics aw ekbal from engineers sub visakhapatnam daba gardens and i am here to put before you the salient features of this uh, staff selection commission that is conducting the examination for the appointment of junior engineers in the government of india organizations including military engineering services and uh, many central government uh, organizations so for this reason this notification that is to come in the months coming months probably in the second week of august stands a very important uh, part for your life defining uh, moments are ahead for you all because if you get a job in the central government organizations then a dream come full, 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 fulfilled for you all because you are looking for for golden opportunities and uh, this examination junior engineers examination 2022 is uh, basically meant for the students who are in the final year and the students who are already passed out their btech degree who are waiting for the jobs right moments even 2021 uh, students because the age limit is uh, 30 years i think so i i i i just gone through it and uh, the students of civil engineering mechanical electrical engineering are basically are uh, very much eligible for writing this examination the notification of which will be expected in the uh, month uh, next month the second week of uh, august and the examination is uh, tentatively we can uh, we are told that it is scheduled So for the month of November, somebody have we come across these websites and come come to the understanding that the examination will be in the month of November. So there is a, a span of three months for you to make a preparation for this uh, examination. If because you are if you are serious, the preparation part will not be a difficult one for those who are very uh, very much disciplined in their preparation. Uh, nothing will be difficult to achieve. that's what we believe from engineer sir the syllabus is also uh, suitably are uh, ready uh, for the diploma holders and uh, engineering graduates both uh, diploma and engineering graduates from any university in india recognized uh, university and uh, the examination will be conducted in uh, two papers first paper is uh, a computer based uh, examination cbt and uh, the second paper is uh, a conventional type examination pen and paper right a written type and therefore similar to the uh, engineering services examination or ia upsc examinations and therefore it no, should not be difficult for because the preparation now will be a preparation for a, for your life it will be useful for you for any examination including the bank examinations as well because general awareness is an integral part of any ex complete examination nowadays and core a preparation in the core subject is a, an important part for the jees because engineering jees is a, a, a technical examination basically and uh, the examination will be conducted in uh, two shifts normally a uh, paper one paper one will be conducted in two shifts the morning shift will be from 10 to 12 depending upon the availability of uh, uh, the slots in the examination centers and in the afternoon shift will be 2 to 2 4 pm 2 pm to 4 pm the duration is 2 hours 2 hours means 120 minutes there will be um, 
a 200 marks for the uh, paper one the questions will be 200 mcqs multiple choice questions will be there and uh, these 200 multiple choice questions are divided subdivided among these three uh, uh, topics one is uh, general intelligence and reasoning uh, the second one is general awareness and uh, the third one of course is your core subject mechanical civil or electrical part a part b part c that's what we say and this part a part b parts individually are 100 marks each 100 questions 100 marks one question one mark and uh, uh, the in general intelligence and reasoning will be for 50 marks and uh, the 50 questions will be there and general awareness will also be for 50 marks there will be 50 more questions a total number of questions will be 200 uh, spanning over a time of uh, 120 minutes remember that 120 minutes and 200 questions that means uh, you will not even have a preparation a writing time of uh, one minute for one question because it will be around 40 seconds for per question remember that concept based these are these questions are all concept based basically may be depending upon uh, or based on their your fundamentals only knowledge on fund fundamentals therefore preparation for the examination is all a completely a theoretical one that in the sense that you do the preparation so preparation is not difficult but going through the examination will be the crucial part going through the examination means you have to sit for 120 minutes attempt as many questions as possible in the span of 120 minutes and these 200 questions whoever answers most number of questions will be the ranker there will be a cutoff of course therefore you need to attempt as many questions as possible with a with a disciplined approach this disciplined approach comes to you by practice this practice has to be taken up either at home or through a reliable institutions a dependable institutions like engineer sub we at engineer sub provide the necessary practical uh, atmosphere practice atmosphere for you students for you um, uh, professional engineering students or graduates who are opting to uh, write this examination who are try trying to acquire a what you call a position in the general central government uh, jobs so for this reason we are here having we are having complete idea about uh, the approach we need to take to make you ready for this examination and that's why we have planned a 100 day program starting with july 18th this monday onwards because unless, unless we start early even before the notification comes out notification is expected in the second week of august probably whereas there is imminent certainty that examination will be conducted notification will definitely be coming the dates may be changed a little therefore preparation you may not be having sufficient time to make a preparation for this reason you need to make a beginning as with a forethought assuming that if not this exam there is another examination so there are a, a dearth of no dearth of examinations for you there is a a complete uh, line of examinations waiting for you because so many central government jobs are open for you so for that reason unless you start a preparation right from now onwards without wasting your time because spending some time once in a week or at least because you already completed most of you final year completed final year they have written the examinations also recently and now they are waiting waiting for the jobs so for that reason instead of idling away the time it is better that you spend time making a preparation the preparation would not come overnight because subject is to be acquired it cannot be mugged up it cannot be taken by heart the for that reason you need to make a preparation for example when you are preparing in a, uh, the general intelligence and reasoning there will be questions on antonyms and synonyms how many english uh, antonyms and synonyms can you master in just a weekdays time it's not difficult it is very difficult so for that reason a proper planning has to be there and with that planning you will be acquiring one by one day by day you are acquiring more and more number of your vocabulary will be improved will be increased and your skills will be mastered because you are doing, doing a, a what you call practice tests you are going through the practice tests with a timer there so you will be learning to respect the time that is very important all these examinations any question you take in the exam all the 200 questions you can answer given three hours or four hours of time 
but answering them in two hours time will be a difficult task. So, for that reason, the filtering will be taken up based upon that one only. Whoever is fast and accurate will be the winner. So, if you can answer out of these 200 questions, at least 120 questions, at least I am telling you because spending one minute per question, you stand a chance at least and you have to improve over that one. Trying to increase, trying to answer 140 questions in 120 minutes, like that. So, that is practice, that is what we call as practice. So, for that practice purpose, with a, a rationale, with a kind of uh, understanding, how to make an ap approach, a, a structure, and self discipline, all these things cannot be um, what you call acquired being at home. There are so many distractions at home. So, for that reason, you need an environment, an atmosphere, a surroundings where you will see to the to your left there are students, who are, they are graduates who are preparing. To your right, there are graduates who are preparing. So, there will be a peer learning also. People will be there this is a, of the same kind of thinking who are also trying to learn by being a, as a as a team. For that reason, joining in an institute, a coaching institute is not a sin but it will be a boon for you all. So, for that reason, choose any institute of your choice, anywhere in India, choose any institute of your choice, completely depending upon the institute also is foolish. Therefore, learn the approach, practice back at home also, practice in the institute, discuss, make a discussion with your, with your friends around. So, all these things, a kind of an integrated approach will be giving you an edge over those students who are not taking this kind of approach for the examinations. So, for this reason, we are here at Visakhapatnam, those students in the vicinity of Visakhapatnam, the students from Vijayanagaram, Vijayawada, even Telangana also, these students can come down to our institute because they are free, they are not going to colleges now. So, they can spend learning the skills, they can spend, make a practice of the, uh, the, the questions, probable questions as, as a part of uh, what you call a question paper, a multiple choice question paper with a timer. So, you will be learning the skills by observing the time also. You want, you can learn to answer as many questions correctly. Remember that this adverb is important, correctly as possible. So, for that reason, it is very important for you all to take a leap, to take a decision, to join the institution of your choice. If you are around this vicinity of this Visakhapatnam, ours, the engineer sub here, located in Daba Gardens, opposite Nelur Mess, is the most competent institution because it is being uh, governed, uh, it is being guided from the forefront by an IITN uh, Negi, Devendra Singh Negi who is a topper, who was a topper from IIT Bombay <coughs> in mechanical engineering and also he has uh, uh, got All India rank 1 twice in 2019, again in 2020 through the XC stream of uh, uh, the gate examination and uh, he, because he knows the ins and outs of uh, how to prepare for the examination because he himself is a All India rank 1. He can, he is the right person, he is the right captain for you to guide to your destination. So, for that reason, I exhort, I just say that I advise you completely to join Engineers Up to take up your preparation for your future, a golden future rather to say, which is not at all difficult to make a preparation through. And we are having for the general aptitude, general awareness and reasoning part also tutors who are more than 10 years of, uh, we have more than 10 years of experience in the field and uh, the mechanical engineering core here is only offline that is being given only in our campus whereas the general aptitude and uh, reasoning uh, papers will be both in the offline and online mode. That is on request, okay. That is a live relay of the offline uh, subject, offline lecture will be taken up for those students who are at home, those who cannot come down to. Remember that we are giving from engineers up, 
we are giving coaching in core subjects of mechanical engineering to start with. In the beginning, we are giving the coaching in mechanical engineering only. And uh, uh, the general aptitude and test that is part one, part one of uh, uh, the paper one will be taken up both offline and online. Those students who cannot come directly to our institute or you know, to the campus, take the uh, lessons in our campus, they can opt for online mode also for general aptitude and test of uh, reasoning. So, these are the uh, phone numbers that you keep in mind uh, in case you want to contact us. Remember that ours is a very important uh, or a very competent uh, institution. We have been providing coaching to uh, the students of engineering. Uh, for over seven years, uh, depending for the GATE, Graduate Aptitude Test Engineering, and most of our students have got, <coughs> have got good ranks in GATE and also have joined in uh, reputed institutions like uh, BARC and Steel Authority of India Limited, HPCL, uh, to name a few. So, remember that we have the expertise to guide you to your uh, right direction and also to make you reach the, the pinnacle of your glory. So, uh, uh, with this, I will be uh, taking leave of you. D remember the phone numbers and uh, do talk to our, uh, our resources here uh, for proper for further guidance. Thank you very much and a very good afternoon, everyone. Thank you. Then.